So I'm Tyeria P. I'm one of the students here at the Flatiron School. And I want to present to you yet another video exhibiting some of the skills I've learned since I've been here. I came up with this idea because I'm really into working out. It's a tad bit Facebook inspired with a combination of other workout sites I've seen. Ultimately, how I picture this is people from all around the world could share their workouts. From military personnel, bodybuilders, personal trainers, average Joes, whatever it may be. Later on, I want to add some capabilities for fitness challenges so people may have more of an incentive to work out. A comment section for the workouts displayed, gains, losses, and many more. Alright, so let's just get right into it. Um, I'll give you a bit of a disclaimer now. There is no CSS styling, so bear with me. This is just a backbone kind of app. So I'm in an appropriate directory currently, so I'll just type rack up so it starts my server and it lets me know what local host to go to. Alright, that's local host 9292, so we can see here. Alright, so the first thing we see is it gives us a welcome message, welcome to Workout Fanatics, which is the name of the site. It gives you a little greeting there. Uh, just so you can see all the processes, I'm going to go through the sign-up page. And we'll make up something, something generic. Uh, let's say Bob. There are no validations or anything you really need to go through besides that you do, in fact, need to put something in every... Um, box here. Alright, so it immediately takes us to the workout page and here's all the workouts we can choose from the Fanatic website and it corresponds to each body part. That is with that is back, legs, abdominal, arms, chest. So right now there shouldn't be any workouts anywhere because we haven't created anything so that will automatically prompt us to think let's create something right so let's create a workout and it welcomes me here thanks me for signing up how kind of workout fanatic and let's call this back massive back workout And this says describe the workout in full reps, sets, names. All right, let's say pull ups. Ten sets by ten reps. It's a lot of pull ups, but that's why we're doing it. We're trying to get a massive back here, right? Ask me what primary body part will this work out? Let's say back, right? This is a massive, massive back workout. Boom, all right, automatically takes me to the back, um, back site, the back path. And now we can instantly see our title and the content displayed. And we can, we can immediately now go back to the workout page. So now we've put something in the back section. So if now if anybody else wants to put something in the shoulder section, the chest section, the arms, we can do the same thing through here. All right. So also we can see all the workouts we posted personally through this link. And here we are. Massive back workout with the workout that we've actually created. So let's click on this. So we can delete the workout, we can edit it, and we can go back to show all the workouts once more. Um, I'm thinking 10 sets by 10 reps might be too over the top. I know we're trying to get a massive back workout, but let's see if we could just change that maybe down to 7 sets. And voila! 
it has been edited and you know what let's just delete it because this workout is insane by itself so we delete it and voila once more it is deleted let's go back to the home page which is where the workouts are let's see if it actually did delete and it did and that's about the gist of it we can log out now and it will wipe out our session and take us back to the um, main home page here if you feel like you want to contribute you can definitely check out the my github at cjhhh slash sinatra workout solo project thanks for tuning in and i'm glad you you've watched it